Rule number one, believe in what you do and the rest of the world will enjoy your magic. You are the performer and illusionist. Make people believe in magic. Rule number two, practice, exercise, and rehearse each trick. Do it in front of a mirror and different places until you see no flaws in your performance. Only then you may perform this magic trick. You will know that you have mastered the magic trick if your trustee asks you. How do you do it? No one should be able to find a clue in your performance on how this trick is done. Rule number three. Keep the secret of your magic. You use your skills to entertain. Revealing the secret is not entertaining. A person will lose interest in you and your magic tricks as soon as you give away the secret of your magic. Revealing the secret does not make anyone happy. The answer for the question, how do you do it, is by magic. Let me show you something else. Keep performing different magic tricks and soon your audience will stop asking silly questions. A well-mannered magician learns from your performance and would never interrupt you. However, your audience attempts to reveal your secrets. Curiosity and competition are parts of our human nature. People know secrets and your performance tempts them to reveal secrets to embarrass you for sake of nothing or just to show off. There is no sure way to prevent it, but you can play along. Let the interrupter perform. Announce the person as your assistant who will perform magic while you are on a five-minute break. Make it as if it was part of your magic show. Rule number four. Sharing knowledge among professionals is common practice in all trades. You may want to learn new tricks from other magicians. So be ready to offer your secret in return. Hello, my name is Michael, and I have to admit that I am not a real magician. I am balloon twister and a magician. Don't be surprised. Balloon animals and magic come along very closely and serve the same purpose, entertaining. I like to have fun and it's always pleasant to impress the most demanding and naive audience of all times. I mean kids. In this work, we, I mean my children and me, present my favorite close-up magic tricks. Plus up tricks performed with objects you can find in your household. This trick is best to perform in one on one or in front of a small group of people. Of course, there are many more amusing tricks as this that works better for big audience. Well, we don't cover those tricks in this work. You may need strong knowledge of science and engineering, special equipment and big stage to perform them. Well, I like to do magic tricks with things that I can find in my pocket on the go and without any assistance. Let me assure you, learning and mastering plus up or street magic tricks is highly regarded and absolutely necessary for magician of any level, either you consider yourself as a professional or amateur magician. We all basically use the same technique to amuse people. This direction, for instance. You will enjoy the knowledge we give you and we hope you will use it wisely to entertain. Let's have fun.